So this is a discussion between Sheikh Kultman bin Barak and this lady right here who uh, uh, in the beginning of the video uh, they call her a Christian woman pastor and I don't know how that can be said but she does seem to uh, try to defend Christianity and you can see her face right here as he glares at her. He's not supposed to be doing that. He's looking at her eye to eye. He should be looking at the ground. Um, that's not a very good uh, reflection of a sheik. But uh, so they're meet on a Sunday afternoon or Sunday uh, evening. They're meeting and they're discussing. He's got a sign that says Jesus is a Muslim and she must be taking ex exception to that. And so now uh, Uthman is talking to her about Islam and the Bible and he's uh, read a series of Old Testament scriptures and asked if she really believes that and uh, asking her if that's just. And uh, you can see the note they put on the screen here. It says, I do not want to speak because you are destroying my false belief system. So that's kind of interesting that they would put those words up there on the screen where they're trying to interject words that she is not saying. It's not true. But I wanted to make a, a comment about what the Apostle Paul said uh, in 2 Timothy 3, verses 1 to 7. It says, The Apostle Paul said, <clears throat> I know this, that in the last days perilous times will come, for men will be lovers of themselves, lovers of money, boasters, proud, blasphemers, disobedient to parents, unthankful, unholy, unloving, unforgiving, slanderers, without self-control, brutal, despisers of good, traitors, headstrong, haughty, lovers of pleasure rather than lovers of God, having a form of godliness but denying its power. And from such people turn away. For, this, for of this sort are those who creep into households and make captives of gullible women, loaded down with sins, led away with various lusts, always learning but never able to come to the knowledge of the truth. And I think that describes Altman here as he's talking to this uh, pretty Christian lady. And Jesus said to people kind of like Altman, he said, you search the scriptures for in them you think you have eternal life, but these are which testify of me, but you are not willing to come to me that you may have a life. Do not think that I, I shall accuse you to the Father. There is one who accuses you, Moses, in whom you trust. For if you believe Moses, you would believe me, for he wrote about me. But if you do not believe his writings, how will you believe my words? How will Altman believe the words of Jesus in the Bible if he's telling this young Christian lady the Bible is corrupt? He's uh, asking her questions, hard questions, that most Christians do not know or how to explain. So he is really being prideful, boastful, arrogant. Those are uh, things that Muhammad said if you have a mustard seed of pride, a mustard seed of arrogance, his destination is not paradise, it will be hellfire. So I pray that he comes to Christ and he'll the, the, turn away from the evil deeds of Islam. In Jesus' name, amen.